This is so beautiful. Oh my gosh, the I lighting is like perfect. And next to that red truck was just like, yeah. I don't know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> they parked it there on purpose. <laughs> Holy smokes. Okay, sorry. They're full. They're acting so weird. <laughs> their lawn is a garden. succulent tree oh there's the thing the weird so the succulent tree of all succulent trees. Never. Awesome. i know we should we shouldn't be on their property but there is a succulent tree oh this is you Tree. So we have some sort of a succulent thing, and it's all over. It's not all bloomed out yet, but it will, and we have jasmine, and my favorite palm tree. Don't know what this is, looks like a poppy, but it is, but it's a shrub, and then there's some nice colored sweet peas inside. That's like an aloe type plant. And all those colorful things are nasturtiums. They they receive a lot here. And there's a cactus. Another cactus. I don't know who did this, but they didn't do a very nice job. Like they just shoved it in the grass, basically. There's the torch and aloe. Aloe, where are you going? Keep going. Feel it just ruined. You just ruined the video. But it's not fully in bloom yet, or maybe it's ending. Here's a Sambidia market. And a jade tree, and so many others. I think they're redoing their property, and so are they. Either that, or they want their house to look like a dump. And oh, the roses do really, really well here. And the cymbidiums are really, really common. Like I see them everywhere. Um, outside of a shop, they just put them in pots and use them as like landscape plants and a lot of people have them in just their garden right in the ground and some guy sells flowers on his property he has a flower flowers for sale like he grows them in his lawn like he took out his lawn and he filled it with flowers 
and he has some video markets, so many, and he cuts them and sells them. A lot of Peru Peruvian Peruvian lilies, I think they're called. There's a bottle brush tree, that's nice. But yeah, he sells them with the Peruvian lilies. And there's more roses and all that stuff. And these are the cypress hedges that grow so tall. Oh, is this, that the, uh, this would be $40 for me. Yeah, those tall ones. Even these are cheap. We have Plumeria cuttings for 20 And some have leaves already. There's pink and yellow and other colors that they wrote on it. So right now we're at a Hawaiian festival. And just popped in here. I just wanted to see the plants.
Saratoga, a village, and they have succulent planters. I don't know what these are, but they're all nice. For sure. I think this is the jade tree, it's the golem type one thing. And they have other things. It's like more here. And all over. This plant is everywhere. So this is a gardenia and there's a bloom. And mine is like a small little thing as a house plant and this one's like a huge shrub. And mine also doesn't look as healthy as this one does, but this one doesn't have a lot of blooms. It has quite a few buds, so maybe it'll all bloom out soon. There's a lot of buds. And this is a scented geranium, I believe. One of the scented ones. Let me try. Yeah, it's a scented one for sure. And then this is, I think it's called Dusty Miller. We have this as like an annual outside. And then it dies later, but... Same thing on the other side, and they have a lot more geraniums down there. And some African daisies and chamomile. What is this? We have alyssum. This is a fat succulent. It's in a planter and with some, I think they're African daisies. Succulents are there is a ginkgo tree. I think it's a ginkgo tree. 